Flyfront Zip application. Assemble all pieces needed for this process. Fuse the fly piece with lightweight interfacing, then overlock all necessary pieces. Place centre front pieces together. Sew from the zip opening to the end of the crutch with a 1cm seam allowance. Place the zip onto the zip guard. Ensure you have a seam allowance between the top of the zip teeth and the garment. Sew the zip to the zip guard. Back tack at the start and the end of the seam to secure the threads. On the right front, attach the fly piece to the centre front opening with a 1cm seam allowance. As you approach the bottom of the fly, ensure your stitch line sits within the seam allowance. Fold the seam allowance towards the fly. Flat stitch the edge of the seam on the fly. Ensure your stitch line sits within the seam allowance. Attach the zipper foot. Attach the zip guard and zip to the left front using a 1cm seam allowance. Edge stitch the seam. Back tack at the start and the end of the seam to secure the threads. Press. Fold the 
fold the fly front under. Position then pin the right hand front over the closed zipper. Ensure zip is positioned well inside the overlap so that the zip and puller are not visible. Turn the garment to the wrong side. Flip back the zip guard to expose the zip. Sew the zipper tape to the fly. Trim the zip if it is too long. Change back to your normal machine foot. To sew the final top stitch, ensure the zip guard is held away from the zip. Top stitch through both the garment and the fly following the shape of the fly. Stitch the fly and zip guard together at the bottom. Lightly press.